What is going on, guys? This is Ben here. In today's video, we're going to open up not one, but two very rare Black Rose Dragon Tins here. So I have opened up a few of these on the channel before. They have first edition Crossroads of Chaos packs. Uh, they're the same go as with the first edition Duels Genesis, where they only came in the sneak peek packs and in order these tins. So very rare Crossroads of Chaos in here. Um, they have the Seeker Black Rose Dragon. We're going to hoping to pull the Ghost Rare of Black Rose Dragon, but you guys know... It is incredibly rare to do that, so we'll see if we can do it, but we get two launch collectible tins, or second launch collectible tins, that's the tin obviously, two Crossroads of Chaos booster packs, one the Duel's Genesis booster packs, one Light of Destruction, one Phantom of Darkness, and one promotional pack, and one variant card. So, the promotional pack is just tokens, the promotional card obviously is the Secret Rare Black Rose Dragon, so we're getting into this, hopefully we get some awesome pulls for you guys ultimate rare or the ghost rare we'll see what happens so we'll take the tin off <clears throat> compared to the older tins the way they package the prom the promotional or the the limited edition card the, the promo card sorry i was looking for the best word there is way better than anything we had before so Black Rose Dragon. Sorry, my, my volume is going off there. If you guys don't know what this does, when this card is synchro summon, you can destroy all cards on the field. Once per turn, you can remove from play one plant type monster from your graveyard to change one monster your opponent controls to face up attack position and reduce its attack till zero until the end phase. Secret Rare Black Rose Dragon. So here we go. We got the, we got the other tin right here. We'll open that in a little bit. But we have our first edition Crossroads of Chaos packs. Unlimited edition, the Duel's Genesis. We have Light of Destruction, Unlimited Edition, and Phantom Darkness, Unlimited Edition, and then the Token Pack. Chilling right here. Set that lightly on the ground. Let's see what we get from the Token Pack. <clears throat> we have a Token. Another Token, and another Token. And then we have a Entry. Free admission. Present this coupon for one free entry to an under 13 tournament or team dueling tournament. Call me another. <laughs> it expires May 2009. We're only a couple months late. So we will open up the other tin very soon here. We'll start off with the Duelist Genesis. See if we can pull that Ghost Rare Stardust. Not first edition, but still. Unlimited edition doesn't matter. Mecha Bunny. Genesis, the Light Sworn Mender. Domino Effect. Big piece golem. So nothing out of the duels genesis. Out of a tin, we're hoping to get at least get one one hollow card. We'll do the first edition Crossroads of Chaos right now. Tins are pretty random. Sometimes you get a bunch, sometimes you get none. Morphtronic, Monotron, Seed of Deception, Pursuit Chaser. We have Virus Cannon. And then we have Gadget Driver. So nothing. Out of the first pack, we'll open up Phantom of Darkness next. Look at that little face on the on the dragon there. A little, a little creepy, if you ask me. Five Ds, one of the awesome, awesome arcs of Yu-Gi-Oh! Chain Summoning. Alchemy, Cycle, Obsidian Dragon, and we have an Ultimate Rare! Awesome, dude. So we pulled an Ultimate Rare out of the tin. I thought it was this ultra at first. Metal Reflect Slime. Ultimate rare. Unlimited edition out of Phantom of Darkness. After activation, special summon this card in defense position. It is treated as an effect monster. It's an aqua type. It's a water. It's a level 10. Attack is zero. Defense is 3,000. This card cannot attack. This card is still treated as a trap card. Metal Reflect Slime. 3,000 defense. That's not bad, dude. It's pretty, pretty beast, beast defender right there. So we got an ultimate rare. That uh, that just all like basically makes the tin. Oh my gosh, nice. First edition. Well, that's not first edition. It's unlimited edition, but still, any ulti is cool. Got that going to the collection binder. <clears throat> we have light of destruction. Let's see, if we can get that ghost. Honest, Arcana Force, XVII the Moon, Raging Cloudian, Uni Frog. Cymorg Berg of Angestry level tuning. <laughs> Let's get that ghost rare, man. Crossroads of Chaos. First edition. See if we can get it. 
So they'll have another chin after this. Poison Chain. Comrade, Sword of Mint, Swordsman of Landstar. Fragrant Storm. Storm Caller. And we have a Queen of Thorns. <clears throat> I'll super act. A little bit of a troll when you see the Synchro Monster. One tuner plus one or more, more non-tuner plant monsters. Each player must pay 1,000 life points to normally special summon a non-plant type monster from their hand. <clears throat> Excuse the, the raspiness in the voice. Currently getting over sick, being sick. So not bad though, an ultimate rare out of that tin. Going into the next tin here. But yeah, been sick for like the last two weeks, man. Hopefully I'm starting to finally get better. Oops. Dropped it a little a little hastily there, but here we go. The Black Rose Dragon. You guys know the drill. We already opened up these two. First edition. <clears throat> Crossroads of Chaos. The Duelist Genesis. Light of Destruction. And then the Phantom of Darkness. And then our token pack. We'll set off to the side. Slowly set that down there. Alright, so we'll sleeve up our Black Rose Dragon. Seeker Rare looks so good, man. Awesome card. So we got two of those. Put our hollows up there. So we pulled two hollows out of the last tin. Phantom of Darkness was the ultimate rare. Let's see if we can get it again. Spell Chronicle. Blue Thunder T45. Double Tag Team. Gladiator Beast. Battle Archfiend Shield. And we have a Metabo Globster. <laughs> Interesting name. Light of Destruction. We did pull a Ghost Rare Honest. Already once. Let's see if we can get that luck again. Garoth, the Light Sworn Warrior. Raging Cloudian. Interplanetary Invader A. D. Fortune. Battery Man Industrial Strength. Goblin Recon Squad. Recon Squad, actually. Can you control a monster that attacks his face-up attack vision card at the end of the battle phase? <laughs> All right, sorry, I just had to check it. So, we are down to our last three packs. The Duelist Genesis. Let's see if we can get that ghost rare, at least an ultimate rare would be awesome. Destruction, Destructotron, Psychic Snail, Genesis, the Light Sworn Mender, Psychic Rejuvenation, Telekinetic Charging Cell. Okay, down to the last two packs. Let's see how this tin is. Morphtronic Cord, Plant Food Chain, Gadget Hauler, Copy Plant, Search Striker, Gadget Driver. All right. Copy plant used to be so good, man. He's a tuner. And once per turn, you can select one face up plant mo type monster on the field to have this card's level become equal to the selected monster's level until the end phase. With copy plant, you can do a lot of crazy XC summonings and stuff with him. Pretty sweet card. And he was a tuner too. So you could overlay or you could synchro. You could use him as a level one tuner if you really needed to. We have doppelganger, zombie, mammoth, seed of deception, nettles. Stormcaller and Knights and Sorcerer as our super rare. So, out of our tins, they weren't terrible. We did get an ultimate rare, two super rares. Metal Reflect Slime. Ultimate rare. Looks amazing, dude. Super sweet to see that. Knight and Sorcerer. Not sure what he does. When this card is special summon, you can remove and play up to two cards from your opponent's graveyard. Pretty good, um, if a lot of people are using graveyard effects, but he has to be special summoned. If it was just like, when this card is summoned, you can remove and play up to two cards from your opponent's graveyard, it would be a lot better. And we have our Black Rose Seeker Rare, Black Rose Seeker Rare, and our Queen of Thorns. So, not bad. Hope you guys enjoy the video. The hunt for the, the Ghost Rare Black Rose, the Ghost Rare Stardust, still continues. Hope you guys enjoy the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Stay tuned for more awesome Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. We'll have a bunch of new ones. Uh, the new set's coming out soon as well, so stay tuned for that. Flames of Destruction. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys later.